hope you guys are having a wonderful day. Welcome back to my channel. I think I mentioned this in a vlog earlier, but I feel like I've hit all different types or phases through quarantine. A couple weeks ago, I went on this huge like online shopping binge. Give you a little backstory. A couple months ago, I wrote a list of everything that I need in my closet. Some things were summer dresses, I needed a new pair of jeans, I needed jean shorts, all that kind of stuff. Um, I did not need bathing suits. What did I order? bathing suits so that haul will be up in a couple weeks because i it's still on back order and all that stuff but i finally got myself some summer dresses i haven't found myself a pair of jeans i think i'm gonna have to wait to go into the store to do that i just don't trust my sizing judgment online <laughs> so i'm gonna do that later but yeah i figured i would show you some summer dresses that i purchased uh i'm very excited about these i haven't tried them on yet so i'll do my try on portion as i go um, but yeah, I stumbled across Abercrombie and Fitch. I really didn't, I haven't shopped there in years. Like high school was the time, you know, you had to have the t-shirt with the moose on it or the holster bird across your chest sort of thing. I got a lot of my stuff at thrift stores. That was my main thing in high school because you had to have the clothing with that logo on it. So I haven't shopped there in years because it's just not my style anymore and i don't even know why i decided to go on the website but i was so surprised at how cute their clothes are like how nice they are and everything and they had good reviews um i watched a couple videos just to see like shipping wise and sizing and all that stuff and uh yeah so uh some of these things are pretty cute and i'm really excited to try them on and i hope they all fit so yeah so the first thing i went straight to clearance because everything was like either I think it was 60% off or 50% off and then you got an additional 25% off. So I got two dresses, a sweater and a bathing suit bottom for I think it was 80 bucks including shipping and all that stuff. So that's pretty good. I was quite impressed by that. And yeah, and the quality, like I'm feeling these clothes and they're actually pretty good. So the first one is this little cami white dress. It has, it's tied up on uh, the shoulder so it's actually just two strings as your shoulder straps. Uh, and then it has a zipper on the side here, which is nice. It's a good material. I think I can go without a bra wearing it. It has two layers to it. It's quite thick and like good stretchy material. This is a size extra small. So this dress was $33.75 Canadian, which I think is a really good price for how nice the material is. And like it feels really thick really nice. I don't think it's going to be too short. I actually noticed that it has a slit along the side, so that's pretty cute. I'm excited to wear that. But yeah. So anyway, I am happy with this purchase so far. I'm going to go try it on and uh, see how it fits. I think it should be a good fit, but yeah. Okay, I didn't feel like pulling out my camera and all that stuff and taking it apart, so please ignore iPhone quality. But I actually really like it. I think it's super cute. I like how it has a little slit. I kind of did a hack job on tying it because it was really loose, so yeah. But anyway, I think it's just super cute to tie on. I'll probably wear this with a cardigan because I'm not a huge person with my arms. I'm very like insecure about that, so i definitely wear a cardigan with it. Um, I'm going to cut that tag off, that little like hanger strap, but I think it's really cute. Uh, I'm excited to wear it. This will be really nice just to throw on in the summertime with a cardigan. And yeah, I'm excited. I really like it. I like how low it is, but like not super revealing, if that makes any sense. All right, next is, is a romper. And I have never purchased a romper before. I'm a little nervous for it. This nice brown and, or like burgundy and white striped romper. So it has like the shorts here. It's thick at the bottom. That's going to be so nice. I'll be able to wear like comfortable underwear in it. I don't think it's see-through, which is nice. Yeah, but it has a nice open back area here with a, with a little button. Here it has a little tie. I didn't realize that it has an open slit in your stomach area. So hopefully that'll be okay. Uh, it's quite low. I'm not good in the chest area, so hopefully that's not a problem. I, I'm impressed by the quality. That actually feels really nice and thick. So it'll probably be like now and then end of summer, like fall time, I'll, I'll wear it because it might be a little too warm to wear in like 30 degree weather. But yeah, my, like, my vision in ordering this was something that I could uh, run around in and still like be comfortable so I can, even just walking around and stuff. I'm not a huge 
dress person in like casually I like to wear like cardigans with it or something that I feel a bit secure in case it's super windy so this I'm, I'm excited to try because I feel a bit more secure and safe and but still comfortable and cute so yeah I'm excited to try that on and I hope I hope it fits me <laughs> that was um, 24.74 oh sorry it's a red stripe tie front romper so here's the romper um, I don't know how I feel about this portion. I feel like this is like a 1940s sleeper set or even swimsuit. I don't know why, but that's just what it reminds me of. It's very comfortable and very thick. Like I feel secure in it. You can't really see my underwear, which is nice. Um, I like that it covers my butt and like it's still long enough. Like it's not too short. Um, the button detail here is actually really cute, but yeah, I don't know how I'm feeling with this and like the whole pattern itself. I'm just, maybe it's just because I've never worn a romper so like this short section just feels a bit weird. But it's cute. I feel like I'll throw it on to like go to the grocery store or even just lounge around in the house in. I don't know. I'll play around with it, learn how to like tie a bow properly. I don't know. And this one I'm so excited about. I saw this because at first I was browsing and I was like, oh that's cute, oh that's cute. And then I saw this and I was like, I need this in my wardrobe. This is something that I love. And it kind of reminds me of like a yoga mom, if that makes any sense. Just like casually going to Whole Foods and like this is what you throw on with a pair of like leggings. <laughs> but I saw this and I just needed it. So then that's what encouraged the whole order. But it's this beautiful light baby blue tie front like wrap shirt. I love it so much. It is so so soft. I think that it's a beautiful A color. I, I, as you can tell, I like blue, um, especially in this time of year when you've got a bit of a tan and like summer and all that and it's warm and stuff like that. Looking at it now, it's quite low, so I'm hoping that it won't be too exposing for me, but I guess I can just tie it a bit tighter. But it does seem a bit see-through and stuff like that, so I will probably have to wear something under it, even just like a white cami. Oh, that is me in high school. Oh, it's just like a full circle. <laughs> but anyway, so I'm excited to try that on and uh, see how it fits. This was $14.99, which was a pretty good deal. They had other colors too. They had burgundy, they had white, and they had a light, not mint, but like a green. And, um, and that looked really nice as well, but I went with blue because I love blue and think it would look nice with the tan and stuff. But for that price, I'm kind of wish I ordered other colors in this as well. So I'm hoping this fits properly and uh, yeah. I love this top. I think it's super cute, very flattering. I'm probably gonna tie this a bit tighter um, and all that because of this part here, it's like bunching up, but I think it's super cute. I just threw it on with black jeans, um, but I think like lounging around the house or like casually going out, I think I'll wear it with like biker shorts, honestly. I think that would look pretty cute. Um, but yeah, it's, it's very like cozy, elegant almost. I like that this has an aspect to it, like it's comfortable, like it's loungewear, but like actually looks kind of decent. So yeah, I'm actually quite surprised with how low the neck is and it actually doesn't look that bad. So yeah, I love the color. I'm so happy with it. It looks good. I kind of want to order the other colors and stuff, but I think I'm just going to leave it at that because I not a need. So yeah, I'm just going to tie that a bit tighter and I'll probably be be good. And last but not least, in order to get free shipping, I actually only needed to spend, I think, four dollars or something like that. So I just went into the whole site and just went from low to high, like pricing. I was like, oh, maybe I'll get a necklace or something like that. And I actually ended up picking up a bathing suit bottom. So I'm quite happy about this because looking at it, it looks like it covers your butt, which is something I've been looking for for a while now. Oh, sorry, I meant with that saying, I want to see how much it was. This was $5.25, which is pretty good. Also, also, all these are Canadian prices, by the way. But yeah, but I just thought it was super cute. They had a, a matching top, and it was like the American flag sort of thing, but I was like, no, oh, I don't really like the top. I'm not a huge, like, triangle with strings. I don't really like those that style that much. Bottoms, I think, will be really nice. Like, I can wear around family and stuff like that, and it won't be, like, super cheeky. It'll, I'm still, obviously, because it's a bikini, you're showing your stomach, but it won't... I'm not gonna be showing my full butt. So I'm quite happy about that. Um, yeah, so this is the 
uh, sheer sucker side knot cheeky bikini bottoms <laughs> and the blue and white stripe. So yeah, so that I'm quite happy with. And they're like good bathing suit material. I have a couple bathing suits from Holster and they're really nice. I actually got this set from Holster. It's, this is a red bandeau and it is the thickest material. I also have a white one but it has the strap and it's a bit low which I love using especially if you're like going wakeboarding or something like that because it's not like falling in your jacket or anything and the bottoms I like doing wakeboarding and stuff as well because it doesn't like ride up when you eat crap in the water <laughs> so yeah so that the those bathing suits are really nice if you want something a bit more like better quality than Zaffle and stuff like that but still play, uh, paying that cheaper price it's just going to uh, Holster or Abercrombie because they're they're pretty good so yeah that is everything for today's video I hope you enjoyed um, I'm quite impressed by Abercrombie and Fitch. I remember them being good quality, but also super expensive. They still have, like, some of their things are still quite expensive, but I think with this sale and everything, it came out to be pretty reasonable. So I'm quite happy about that. The quality is great. I'm really impressed by that. And yeah, I think I'll start looking more into Abercrombie and Fitch and everything like that, because I think it's a good brand. And, but yeah, oh, I just gave away my sweatpants. <laughs> I'm wearing sweatpants under lace. I didn't want to put on jeans yet. Uh, I think it's a good brand. I definitely want to look more into their clothes. I remember their jeans being really good, but I didn't fit into them while I was in high school. So maybe I'll check them out now. I'm very happy I've kind of rediscovered that brand and I'll sh definitely continue shopping there. And so in their sales section, I still think their clothes are a bit pricey, but I'm, uh, I'm quite impressed. So yeah. So I'll leave all the links down below in the description so you can go check them out. Let me know if you have been purchasing from Abercrombie & Fitch lately or in general and or if there's any other stores that you are enjoying right now, let me know. But anyway, if you enjoyed the video, give it a thumbs up and don't forget to hit that subscribe button down below so you won't miss out on any future videos from myself. And yeah, I hope you all have a wonderful rest of your day and I'll see you in my next video. Bye!